One of my all-time favorite Christmas songs is Santa Claus is Coming to Town, specifically Bruce Springsteen's live version. For me, the Christmas season doesn't officially begin until the first time I've heard it on the radio. I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to town. One of the mysteries for me was why did Springsteen start laughing in the middle of the song? And that got me wondering about its history. Well, let's go back to the beginning. In June 1934, on a subway ride to Brooklyn, J. Fred Coots, a prolific songwriter who had been creating music for Broadway shows, encountered Haven Gillespie, a newspaper journalist and lyricist. Gillespie mentioned he had an idea for a Christmas song but needed some music for it. He later visited Coots after one of his matinee performances, and Coots, somewhat unenthusiastically, agreed to work on Gillespie's kid song. In a mere 10 minutes backstage, Coots crafted the tune's basics, thinking of it as a stepping stone to work on Gillespie's future ballads. Initially, the publisher, Leo Feist, was skeptical, thinking a kid's song wouldn't sell, but agreed to publish it. The first recorded version was by Harry Reeser and his orchestra in October of 1934. You better not cry, you better not pout, I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is coming to town. He's making the song's list. fortune turned when Eddie Cantor decided to use it on his radio show over Thanksgiving of 1934, catapulting it to immense popularity. You better watch out, you better not cry, better not pout, I'm telling you why, Santa Claus is coming to town. He's making a the day after Cantor's broadcast, orders for 100,000 copies of the sheet music flooded in, and by Christmas, sales soared past 400,000. It would become one of the most recorded songs in history. The thing that strikes me most about Springsteen's version is the chorus. In the original version of the song, every syllable of Santa Claus is coming to town is on a downbeat, with only the second syllable of coming lasting two beats. It's Santa Claus is coming to town. In Springsteen's version, the first beat is silent, the San in Santa begins on the second beat, lasts a beat and a half, and the rest of the phrase is sung in eighth notes. it makes it much more soulful than the original Foxtrot version. However, Springsteen wasn't the first to use this arrangement. In 1970, the Jackson 5 released their Christmas album with a similar sounding chorus. Santa Claus to town, oh yeah! Santa Claus. Though both the Jacksons and Springsteen's versions were based on Phil Spector's arrangement recorded by the Crystals in 1963 on the album A Christmas Gift for You. first version I found to have a silent one beat and then swing the rest of the phrase seems to originate in 1943 with Bing Crosby and the Andrews sisters. Santa Claus is coming to town. That arrangement was then used by Perry Como in 46, Frank Sinatra in 48, and it's likely Spectre took some inspiration from there. The Springsteen version that we all know and love was recorded live at CW Post College, now Long Island University Post Campus in Brookville, New York, on December 12, 1975. The first known performance was in 1973 at Roger Williams University in Bristol, Rhode Island, but there don't seem to be any recordings from that time. However, there are quite a few recordings from 1975, with the earliest recorded version of Santa Claus on an audience tape of the December 2nd, 1975 show at Boston Music Hall. It's a familiar arrangement, even with all the patter at the beginning of the song, where he asks the band if they've been practicing real hard. We've also got recordings from December 11th in New Jersey and December 17th in Buffalo, New York, 
One of the questions I always had was what is Bruce laughing at in the middle of the song? I couldn't find any video from the 1975 shows, but there are some from 1978. It seems like he's just laughing at Clarence Clemens doing his ho-ho-hos during the breakdown section. <laughs> the full band then comes back in for another rousing chorus. And the song ends with a simple piano version of Jingle Bells. Ho, 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 ho.